Baldassare Castiglione's The Book of the Courtier is a cornerstone of Renaissance literature, presenting a comprehensive guide to the ideals and conduct expected of a perfect courtier in the 16th century. Written in the form of dialogues that take place over several evenings at the court of Urbino, the book is structured around discussions among a diverse group of nobles, aiming to define the characteristics, virtues, and skills necessary to become an exemplary courtier. At its core, Castiglione's work revolves around the concept of the cortigiano, or courtier, who embodies a combination of refined qualities, including grace, wit, physical prowess, and knowledge in various fields. The courtier is depicted as someone who effortlessly navigates social situations, adeptly switching between conversations on topics ranging from literature and the arts to politics and sports. Through these dialogues, Castiglione emphasizes the importance of balancing physical and intellectual abilities to achieve courtly excellence. One of the primary themes in the book is the concept of sprezzatura, the art of making difficult tasks seem effortless. Castiglione argues that a courtier should possess this quality, mastering the ability to perform various tasks skillfully while concealing the effort behind them. Sprezzatura requires a delicate balance between natural talent and practice behavior, enabling the courtier to appear both polished and spontaneous. Furthermore, the book delves into the role of women at court. Castiglione challenges traditional gender roles by advocating for the education and participation of women in intellectual discussions and courtly activities. He presents the character of the ideal court lady, the cortigiana, who is well-educated, socially graceful, and able to engage in conversations on an equal footing with male courtiers. This portrayal of women as intellectual equals was progressive for its time and contributed to discussions about gender roles in Renaissance society. The text also discusses the importance of moral integrity and ethical behavior. Castiglione emphasizes the significance of virtues such as honesty, integrity, and loyalty in the conduct of a courtier. He suggests that while outward appearances and social graces are important, they should be complemented by a strong moral compass. The courtier must not only be skilled in the arts of conversation and physical activities but also possess a virtuous character. Moreover, the book reflects the socio-political context of the Renaissance, offering insights into the changing dynamics of power and influence in Italian courts. Castiglione acknowledges the impact of politics on court life and discusses the courtier's role in serving the ruler while maintaining personal integrity. The courtier is seen as a mediator between the ruler and the people, requiring diplomatic skills and tact to navigate complex political situations. In essence, the Book of the Courtier serves as a manual for achieving excellence in courtly life, encompassing a wide range of qualities and skills essential for a Renaissance courtier. Castiglione's work continues to be celebrated for its timeless wisdom, offering valuable insights into human behavior, social etiquette, and the pursuit of virtue. Its influence extends beyond the Renaissance, shaping discussions on manners, ethics, and the art of social interaction for centuries to come.